Hi, I'm George from Doctor's Toy Store and today I'm going to show you how to export from the Sonoscape A6 to a USB. Um, this is a bit of a complicated process but it's nothing you can't do. Uh, it's actually not that hard once you get used to it and it shouldn't take too long. Um, like I said in the previous video, Sonoscape actually recommends Kingston and uh, SanDisk. Uh, but I've had um, very good success with Lexar. So we'll just go on and carry out with that. So first thing, we're going to go ahead and plug in the USB into any port, really. And it's going to actually recognize the USB. You see right there, it just recognized it right there. Um, and pretty much this is after you finish the exam. So the exam is closed. Um, to export on this, you're going to have to go to File, this File button right here. You're going to click on it. And this is going to come up. This is your system directory. Um, this is where all your patients are going to be. Of course, this is a new system, so it's only the test that I just did now. Uh, so you would want to go ahead and just click on the patient. Um, and you would actually be transmitting uh, picture uh, per picture, not just the whole study because, of course, this is a budget ultrasound and you don't want to go ahead and have it take too long. Uh, it's a lot simpler to do it this way. So we see here all the pictures that we took. Uh, it's only three of them and they're in the type of bitmap. Um, basically you have three other ways of doing it. You can actually save it as a JPEG bitmap as it is right now or a DCM for DICOM. Um, so we're actually going to go ahead and um, start doing this. So this is very simple. All you do is come over here and you click on the picture and you go ahead and uh, copy. File, copy, and then you come over here to drive click on that and go to A. It's always going to be A unless you have something else. And you have this. This is from the previous um, video on the S2. And then you go ahead and paste. Remember it has to be a file paste, not a directory paste. Now this is just going to go ahead and take a little moment. And there you go. We see the picture right down there. It is a bit tedious, but you know you have to keep going back to the patient and do it one by one. And you go ahead and you get used to it, and it's no time at all. And then just paste. And you go back. System. Click on the patient. And let's do the last one. Copy. And. Alright, thank you very much for watching. Have a nice day.